In the 19th century, women prepared food for their families using simple cooking utensils from the food they grew in their gardens. Many families planted two gardens a year, one in the spring, which would supply greens, peas, and radishes, and one in the summer, which would provide hardier vegetables such as pumpkins, beans, potatoes, and squash. Early frontier cooking was largely based on a place and season. Native plants and animals supplied most of the food. Other necessities such as flour, dried beans, coffee, sugar were stocked in bulk at points of origin and repackaged for sale. Many of the first pioneers in most places ate by campfires. By necessity, foods were cooked by very basic methods. They typically used Dutch ovens, frying pans, boiling pots, and roasting spits to prepare their food. Variety improved as their settlement grew. Improvements in housing and transportation provided a greater variety of food. The ultimate goal for a pioneer woman was the purchase of an iron stove, like the example located here in the Hill House.